Hey, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Easy Money Zone, and I'm back with another reaction. Hey, look, man. We got um Krishan Rock and Blueface Crazy in Love Episode 2. You feel me? Now, I've been on TikTok like all day scrolling and shit like that. And I came across Krishan Rock and Blueface. Family was fighting them. You feel me? And I watched it a little bit in another, like, I think, like, stream or some shit, maybe. I don't know. But I wanted to put my input on in my review, and I wanted to get the whole full story on what's going on, because I, if I could, I would watch this shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I actually want to. I want to watch this shit every fucking week. I want to see what the, like, because it's raw footage. Like, the shit ain't fake. You know it's not fake, bro. So, I, I actually want to get it, but I don't have Zeus. Like, what the fuck? It's only on this fucking app called Zeus, and I don't I don't fucking have that shit. I don't know who does. Like, what the fuck? Who, what the fuck is a Zeus? But, um, if they put this shit on Netflix, it's shit called The Trending. But I wanted to put my input on it and just get the full story of everything. Why do y'all see on me? It's going up. I got you. Episode Facts. two okay. of Crazy in Love. Now y'all know how episode one ended. If not, go back and watch the video that I pinned to the top. So after she sped off in the minivan, she comes back around and pick Blueface up, and then they go to the bowling alley. Now inside okay. the bowling alley, like true pimp fashion, Blueface is in there trying to get Krishan shit face by offering her shots. Okay. Every time you turn around, Blueface is offering this girl a drink. I am convinced he likes to keep her drunk for some reason. So while they in a bowling alley, Blueface is like low-key instigating the whole incident with her and her family. He's constantly asking her, like, so you over them? You over your family? You're not messing with them anymore? It's like, okay. dude, if you and your family are on bad terms, don't try to get this girl and her family to be on worse terms than what they already are. So her sister texts her and let her know that they all at the hotel and they ready for them to pull up. And a blue face, you know, he's like, he low-key ready to get disrespectful because oh, wow. Krishan tells him that the brother really don't want to meet him. But the brother decides to pull up to the bowling alley where they at. The new ever since E3. Okay, so 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 far I do not have an input on anything yet. It just sounds like some regular like some basic shit. You know what I'm saying? Your life and your budget. Oh, shut the, the fuck up. So okay, so that's Krishan Rodgers' little brother right there. And him and Krishan, you know, they happy to see each other. She introduced him to Blue, and they decide that they want to go outside, and Mookie basically want to have a man-to-man -man conversation with Blueface. Now, at first, I thought Mookie was giving, like, clout chaser, but once he started talking, you could tell he genuinely cares about his sister. Mookie was making a lot of sense. He told him, he told Blueface that they was the definition of toxic. He needs to treat his sister better. Like, if y'all gonna be on the internet doing all of that, you need to be on the internet eating her butt crack, too. Like, yeah, I was confused when he said that also. So, Blueface was basically saying he wants her family to make her accountable for her actions also. Facts, because facts, facts, facts. Hey, that's just true facts right there. You know what I'm saying? No matter, bro. She puts her hands on this nigga, bro. He puts it. He she puts his hands on her, and he swings back. That's just the issue with it. You know what I'm saying? He he does put his hands on her, but it's more of like, like 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 we gotta put it in perspective like this, bro. We 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 still talking about oh uh, the whole Chris Brown and Rihanna situation. Like thir it was like 13 years ago, bro. But we cherish these niggas like they fucking does. But we gotta understand like like. She hit him, you know what I'm saying? If she hit him, now me personally, I can control my anger. That's just different me. So if a girl hit me, I'm just gonna, I'm not trying to say I'm walking away. You feel me? Oh, hold on, somebody's phone. Hello? Uh huh. Okay. Okay. One in five? Alright. Alright. Bye. God damn, boy. Hold on. Alright, 
right. Muscle, 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 muscle. All right, we, we back at it. Oh, no, Krishan be wilding out. But Mookie was like, you know, it was giving like, oh, she's the baby. She can't do no wrong. Who child? So they. You see, like, I don't like that. Now, you that's how they treat me. immediately tell that Blueface was uncomfortable because he was trying to act like he was so into So that's family. her mom. That's her and mom. Sean was like, come on, like, come meet my family. Like, come on. And he's like, no, you need to go meet your family. Go over there, you know, so that way they could be on camera. They're not going to be on camera if you're not, you know, like you got to handle business. Like, Blueface, you know they are there to meet you. You know they want to meet you. So the sister, you, oh, my God, the sister with Damn. the orange hair, she is just like Krishan, like just wild, <laughs> over the top, loud. No, bro. So, Her, I bro, I fucking hate this bitch. I hate this. Bro, I hate this bitch so much. Like, I actually just hate this. Like, bro, you see, I'm a respectful nigga. I'm a respectful nigga. I respect women. And all that. But she's a pure bitch bro from what i seen bro from what i seen bro this girl right here is a pure bitch kershawn her all her sisters her whole family is full of straight assholes bro everybody in her family is an asshole no one is nice bro no one can have no no, no one can walk up hey how you doing you know what i'm saying you having a good day how, how's your day going did you eat today nah it was straight instantly on shit bro and they Nigga, everybody, look, the pops right here look like he's sparring somebody. This nigga is fighting invisible, man. Like, what the fuck is he doing? And this nigga look like he just ready to fight somebody. He look like he thinking about fighting somebody. And she look like she just drunk as fuck. Like, the, and this is her family, you know what I'm saying? Her whole, and I don't know where the fuck the rest is. I think somebody's right behind her. But who is this nigga fighting? Is he good? Her older sister, her face is blurred out. Yeah, she I don't like her older sister she, either. You know, I don't like she's that. She's like girl. confronting him, basically. Her. Like, she's like the voice. She's the family manager, you can tell. So she's telling Blueface, like, you know, you know, when that ish hit home, it hurt. And Blueface, he got a little smart mouth. He like, well, is she doing better? And the sister is like, That's well, true, though. I That's true, though, bro. Like, bro, they're trying to make it seem like, like, Blueface didn't take this bitch out the slums. I mean, I don't know if she was in the slums because, like, she did have a like she was i think she went to like cool good high school and shit but like he damn her to like bro she went to the bgc um gr the, the girls club at his house he took her out of there he felt bad for her when she lost her tooth you know what i'm saying got got with her changed her fucking life like like bro he like she's doing better she's just crazy as fuck i don't know you know is she covering up is she covering it up with the jewels and everything and Krishan was literally on mute while her sisters were talking to Blueface. Even Mookie was real, telling bro, her, was like, quiet. nah, like, be quiet, don't say nothing. The dad come up and he get all up in Blueface's face. Now, I must admit, at the end of the day, you really can't be mad at her family for bucking up at Blueface like that because it's like, dude, you No, 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 here's why, though. Here's my thing about it. I would understand if Krishan Rock was over here crying, hugging on her family, and was like, this nigga hit me, and all types of shit, bro. Bro, they going off of some internet shit, you feel me? And she's behind this nigga hugging him, bro. She's saying, fuck her family, fuck her pops, I'm with this nigga. I'm on this nigga's side, no matter what he did. Doesn't that automatically tap something in your brain like, hold on. Maybe, um... You know what I'm saying? Maybe there's not an issue here. You know what I'm saying? Like maybe like the problem's resolved. She loves she clearly loves this nigga. Look at her. She don't want no parts in this, bro. She's hug wrapped around him, hugging him. He just they, like the whole family's going on and on and on. And she's like, why? Like, bro, fuck, like, leave it alone type shit. You feel me? That's how you know. Like, the issue isn't as bad as they're making it seem. She knows something that they don't know. She like, yeah, I did put... She's like, hmm, maybe I did put my hands on this nigga. Maybe maybe, maybe I did touch this nigga. Maybe, maybe, maybe I did punch him. You know what I'm saying? Maybe maybe I might have did this and that. Maybe I might have fucked up his crib. Random, you know what I'm saying? Through put holes in his wall and shit. Shit that any regular nigga would hit me for. Hmm, maybe. But just because this nigga's a celebrity, he can't put his hands on me. I could put my hands on him, though. Like, like, it's like that shit, you know what I'm saying? As a man, my daughter, person, like, all right, you're going to be my queen, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to buck up too.
But honestly, though, if you're doing this and you're automatically saying, fuck me, fuck you, I'm still with this nigga, hands down, and you're not sad about the issue, fuck you. You know what I'm saying? All right, cool. Nigga, y'all happy. You, you're happy, clearly. As long as you're happy, I'm cool. If she was over here, like I said, crying, blah, blah, asking for her, saying, fuck that nigga, I don't want to fuck with, then it's like, okay, we got to handle it. Getting put getting at our sister that's like just this. my input keep putting hands on our sister like this like that's the code of the street if you got a hood family a ghetto family it's like we gonna rally our cousins we gonna rally our uncles our brothers and they gonna let you know what the deal is respectfully nah. Nah. but in blueface defense he wants her family to tell her she needs to kick back she needs to calm down stop with all the bull ish Thanks. But her family ain't trying to hear none of that. They trying to put the demonstration down to Blueface. They trying to let him know what it is. Meanwhile, Krishan is like on mute. She's trying to say stuff here and there, but her sister's steady barking at her like, don't you say nothing. You better be quiet. And they telling the dad like, go ahead, dad. Say your say what you need to say, daddy. So that bitch ass thing you got so laid out. Daddy is steady bitch. getting all up in his face and Krishan is trying to push the daddy back and everybody coming down on Krishan like, nah, you stay in your place. Nah, stop that. You, you kick back. Her brother telling her, you know, we trying to talk on your behalf. Like, you need to shut up right now and let us do this right now. Let us let us get up in this nigga ass real quick. And Blueface, you know, fuck? bless his heart. He started asking the daddy, you know, have you ever hit a woman before? Now, the whole world know that Krishan daddy was tagging the mama for years. And the daddy tells Blueface like... Nigga, what? What? I didn't know that. I did not know that. Hold on, hold on. No, no, no. That changes the that 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 pushes me on Blueface's side. That 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 just relieved me on Blueface's side. That just kicked me to Blueface side. You feel me? Blueface is in the fucking right, bro. Hundred percent. What the fuck, bro? This this nigga's a he's a hypocrite. He's a hypocrite. And you can't tell me this nigga in the green ain't never hit nobody and never hit a bitch before. But look, this nigga right here, he's a hypocrite, bro. Bro, and then he was like, like I seen a clip, bro. This nigga said, "Oh, I went, I, I, I already been through this. I, I been, I been stabbed by a girl, and I went to jail with a knife in me or some shit like that." Like, nigga, no one give a fuck. Boy, this nigga was hitting, bitch. He was hitting the wife. That's the crazy part. The wife, the wife. Damn you know right, me? I did, cause she was being disrespectful. Like, blue face. This is not the time to try to defend yourself for putting hands on Krishan. You better just sit there and just take the little verbal beating that her family is trying to give hell right no nah. blueface is better than me because i would have bro it would have been straight violations straight hands bro i would have brought up so much money bro like 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 like, like bitches you're on my like bro straight like if i was blueface bro you're on my show i changed your daughter's life my nigga and then i seen a clip and like i think it was her this girl right here said um she's the reason why you came up I would have pulled out numbers so fast, bro. See, I don't like Blueface as a rapper. I don't listen to this nigga. This nigga is trash. He's ass, bro. But let me tell you something. He's in the right, and his numbers do not fucking lie. This nigga has numbers. Like, I'm... <laughs> he he does fucking numbers. He he used to. I don't know. He, he don't really rap no more because he's dealing with shit like this. But when he was rapping, and he was going on that long run with Annalie Chopper and shit like that. This nigga was putting up numbers. My nigga, Tatiana had the world in shambles. My nigga, I bet she was she was probably a senior in high school when Tatiana came out hitting that motherfucker before she jumped on the track. You feel me? Because she was a track star type shit. I'm trying to tell y'all right now, Blueface is at the fucking right, bro. If you, if you think other, otherwise, bro, you're you fucking... Krishan know how her family gets down, that they a little dirty because she was studying... Like, look at her, bro. She's standing right in front of this nigga, bro. She loves him. her family was trying to low-key hold her back and walk Blueface down the street. I mean, it start giving, come outside, we just want to talk. Mm. And Blueface was giving, my mama said, if somebody hit me, hit, hit them, them back. back. Yes. Y'all, this whole scene what? was wild. Everybody was saying so much stuff. I had to rewind and hear what this person saying, rewind it back and listen to the other person. Even the mama was telling Blueface, Oh, you came up because of, because of her. Look, I told y'all. It was the mama. It was the mama. It was the mama. I told y'all, bro. Bro, somebody said that shit. I knew it. Bro, they said, you came up because of Krishan. 
Bro, I would have pulled, bro. He's so humble, bro. Because I would have pulled out numbers and stats so fast, bro. I would have been like, before I met your daughter, bitch, I was pulling in. Oh, what is the game? What the fuck? Hold on. This nigga said, like, Blue Face is respectful. Yeah, you was down. You came back up because of her. Whole time, Krishan on mute. But she starts standing in front of him. And. Mm -hmm. See, she loves Blue Blueface is asking her, like, why you keep on getting in front of me? Why you keep on getting in front of me? And her sisters is like, oh, because she trying to protect you. She trying to protect you. Like, man, I don't need no protection. The way mm. Blueface was acting in this scene, you can tell. That nigga put hands on her. He puts hands on Krishan. When she get out of line, he put the smiggity smack down on her. But based on the way her family was acting... Ooh, I see where Krishan get that wildness from. Now, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Her whole family was wild. But he low key scandalous. He go up and tell the daddy to basically sneak Blueface and pop him in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that ended bad. I know that ended bad. That ended bad. That ended bad, man. Fuck, man. I hope he knows. I hope this nigga the green shirt knows, bro. You are the reason. Of all of this, bro. Your dad got put into the fucking hospital in a coma, induced coma. You know what I'm saying? Probably got a fucking heart attack. The nigga's like 62. You know what I'm saying? Because you wanted him to sneak a crip, bro. You wanted him to a sneak a fucking neighborhood crip, bro. Are you for real? You wanted your old ass pops who was being on your mama, bro, to sneak a neighborhood crib. You wanted your your old ass ninety five year old daddy to sneak a, a neighborhood crib, nigga. Is you fucking stupid? Then and then not just that, Blueface is a fucking crash dummy. The nigga. Nigga, nigga swing on him. He already told y'all what was gonna happen. He thought he was he was playing. The nigga is like twenty two. He's young. He don't give a fuck. He's nigga. This nigga. Know why he did? Bro, let's put it like this. But Blueface went was just got locked up for shooting at a nigga or shooting a nigga, bro. This nigga got locked up for beating on the wife and got he got stabbed and went to jail with a knife in him or some shit. That, cause soon as he did that. The schoolyard crib came. Right schoolyard crib. My fault. My fault. My fault. No, hey, yo, I'm sorry if I disrespect to anybody, but a schoolyard Why crib. Schoolyard crib. My fault. My fault. Daddy sneak blue face. Ain't nobody protecting the daddy because. <laughs> no, I got bro, bro, bro. This nigga turned his back. <laughs> no one. Blue face ran right about oh, and hit him with a haymaker. Knock daddy right to the yep. ground. Yeah, and I would have, bro. Blue face like, in the yeah, fucking yeah, right. Yeah, like blue face in the right. Yeah. Y'all, it was a literally a ghetto melee out there. They even tried to go inside the hotel, and the hotel staff was like, uh-uh, don't bring that ghettoness up in there. I'm sorry, no, like, it took a long time for the cops to come. Her family was trying to eat Blueface. <laughs> but I have a question for the family. Did y'all have that same energy when daddy was putting hands on y'all mama? Thank you! Thank you, oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you, bro. Like, fuck. Bro, you guys are worried about, like, like, bro, you worried about two fucking superstars, bro, who, you know what I'm saying? Like, look at, like, look at Krishan right now, bro. Like, do I really need to say too much? Like, like, Krishan is crazy. I'm putting my hands on her, too, or I'm leaving the relationship, bro. I can't do that. Like, and then, y'all, did y'all have that same energy when he was being on moms? You know what I'm saying? Like, this is crazy, bro. Thank you. Yeah, after that whole little situation, I see why she called him daddy now. She might as well call him <laughs> mama also and brother and sister. Damn, she, oh, damn. Her family, I don't think her family messing with her like oh, that. Oh, no. After damn, and the tweet too? But anyway, y'all, next week, it looked like something with her going to court or something. I, I couldn't even pay attention because I was still just like in awe at everything. But they're taking I that shit to the... Watch. You know, after seeing this episode, it really made me understand Krishan a lot more in yeah, everything that definitely. she has been through in her life, everything definitely, she definitely, definitely, with her parents and her siblings growing up. I understand why she has so much pent up 
anger and anxiety and why she's constantly crying and drinking. It's like if Krishan is not drinking, she's crying. And I'm wondering, is that the reason why Blueface is constantly giving her, her drinks alcohol because she's so she can escape her Wow, emotions. bro. Every time she hugged one of her family members, she cried. Every time she's talking to Blueface, it's like she's on the verge of tears. Bro, she this could is... definitely benefit from some type of therapy or counseling. Hell, even an antidepressant at this point. I just hope, you know, everything turns out for the best with her in her life, in her career. And, you know, she's not yeah. exploited by the Zeus Network. But if that is the case, I will be tuning in. Hey, man. So, like, honestly, bro. Like what she said, bro. Like honestly, bro, that made me like look at Kashan like a lot differently. You know what I'm saying? You see where her fam her family's crazy as fuck. Her mom used to get beat by the pops. Like, like she's dealing with a crazy ass nigga. I'm like, like Blueface is crazy as fuck. But all in all, bro, Blueface was in the right. Blueface was in the right. Um, I'm not saying that he was like for beating the fuck out of her, but I'm saying in the situation of him hitting her dad and everything he was in the right now obviously y'all don't see the clips because they can't show them on youtube but if you ever see the clips um you gotta understand blueface was respectful the whole time the whole time he was respectful you know what i'm saying he might have said like a little smart shit here and there like um is she living good or some shit like clean off and just little shit but he never got loud see other people would have got loud and would have would have been fighting at first three minutes but he kept his school calm and collected so um bluefish was in the right but i'm also really understanding kashan so kashan gets a w kashan gets a w and bluefish gets a w we got two w's today you know what i'm saying but the family gets a big fat l big fat l family gets a big fat l you feel me but anyways, ma'am, um, if you guys ever want to tune into a uh, crazy in love and y'all decide y'all want to get that little Zeus app, go ahead and slime me y'all memberships. Anyways, man, he's my son, this man. I'll catch you later.